Stats for the month of September are in, and the month of September ended up being a pretty interesting month. First of all, we saw our first year-over-year -year increase in sales volume, about 2%, in a very long time. And secondly, while our attached segment of our market and our apartment segment of our market continue to be challenged, we're really starting to see stability in the detached segment of the market. The average benchmark price for the month of September 2016 was $503,400. And yes, while that's a 3.3% decline versus the same time last year, it's also the second consecutive month we've seen that number. For buyers, the question is, if we're expecting further declines in the market, why would I buy something today? And the answer really comes back to, what are you looking for and where? The reality is, buyers may not see further price declines in the product they're looking for. It will depend on the price point, the segment, and the district they're looking in. 2016 has been a very unpredictable market. So to say that that buyer may realize further declines in price in what they're looking for is very difficult to say. For sellers, the question is, where do I need to price my home to get it sold? And that's not a new question. Sellers have always had to ask themselves that question. But the answers are getting very interesting because we're really seeing some different sales prices and sales volume in different districts, segments, and price points. This is a challenging market to be testing the waters or throwing a fishing line and hoping for a bite. If you're selling in today's market, you need to have the most up-to-date information and statistics about what's going on around you. And the best source of that information are members of the Calgary Real Estate Board who have been empowered with business intelligence to provide to consumers.